A five-year-old boy whose home was destroyed in the devastating Moore, Oklahoma tornado last month died Monday afternoon after being attacked by a friend's dog. The boy, whose name has not yet been released, was staying with family friends in Jesseville, Arkansas, while his parents remained in Moore to rebuild their home. He was reportedly throwing a fit Sunday afternoon when the family friend's 116-pound bull massive began attacking him. The child was putting on some shoes and was crying and upset and the dog possibly took that as being aggressive and at that time the child was attacked. According to KLRT, 50-year-old Lynn Geeling and her husband are the owners of the dog. She told police she tried to pry the dog off the boy, but by the time it stopped attacking, the boy had sustained major lacerations to his head and neck. Geeling's husband drove the boy to an ambulance where he was then transported to an emergency room at Mercy Hospital. He was pronounced dead soon after. The dog ran away after the incident, but was reportedly put down by a neighbor later on that day. NBC News points out bull massives aren't the same as the notorious pit bull terrier, which is commonly bred to be an aggressive fighting dog. Instead, these dogs are bred to serve as watchdogs and protect the home. The American Bull Massive Association says the breed is usually very good with children, but cautions you should never leave a young child unattended with a dog, especially children new to the home. Investigators have yet to determine if the owners will face charges in the boy's death. For Newsy, I'm Jasmine Bailey.